The Supreme Court has hauled up Imran Khan. It has questioned the rules related to the extension of an army chief's tenure and the rap comes amidst a crucial hearing in the country's highest court of law after its army chief, Lieutenant General Khamar Javed Bajwa, was given a three-year extension by the Pakistani government. The crucial case is being heard amidst some actions that the Pakistani defense establishment has taken against India under the guise of national security. Now, under General Bajwa's leadership, Prime Minister Imran Khan, through an official notification back in August 9, on the 19th of August, had granted a three-year extension to General Bajwa, citing regional security reasons. Now, Bajwa's original tenure is set to end tomorrow, 19th, 29th of November. However, in an unprecedented move, Pakistan's Chief Justice suspended the government's order, citing legal lacunae. Now, the Pakistani Apex Court put four main questions for the Imran Khan government to answer. The court also questioned the law under which the appointment was done. It also has questioned the procedural lapses in Bajwa's appointment. Suspension of Bajwa's retirement was also questioned as the court asked if the rules apply to the Chief of Army staff or not. Now, the powerful Pakistani army, which through its favoured regimes has ruled the country for more than half of its 70 plus years of existence, has wielded considerable power in matters deciding the issues of security and foreign policy. But this is the first time that the Supreme Court of Pakistan has slammed the Imran Khan government. On the other hand, as per sources, the government has prepared a new draft to address the reservations of the Supreme Court. This after the Pakistani Prime Minister Imran Khan had called for an urgent meeting of key ministers, including the Chief of the Army Staff, General Bajwan. At least three people have been injured as two large explosions rocked a chemical plant in the United States state of Texas, blowing out windows at nearby homes and sending plumes of orange flames into the sky. Now, the dramatic footage from the scene shows the moment when the flames were sent seen billowing up in the sky. The explosion took place at the TPC plant that makes products for chemical and petroleum companies. The second blast happened almost 12 hours after the first one. The authorities said that the smaller explosion apart from two major blasts also kept taking place throughout the day. Evacuation orders were issued in the site's vicinity.